Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video here on the channel. In today's video, it's not really a let's play or episode of starting a new series. It's basically a showcase video of Skyblock Utopia V2, which is OP Legends brand new Skyblock Realm releasing June 11th, which is this Saturday at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I make this video to kind of show y'all what the heck's going on and, and what's up with the server. And also let y'all know that your boy is going to be recording his new Skyblock series on here. So, I'm stoked for it. As you can see, it's pretty custom just alone from the texture pack you can see. But I'm going to be kind of running down a lot of the... Uh a lot of the things that the server have uh, in this video now starting off before we hop into it we're giving away a thousand credits which is basically their like slash buy so their credits is their currency system you use so if you go buy credits off their store with real money we're basically giving away like fifteen dollars for free is how you could see it um and so with these a thousand credits you can go to buy five relic keys if you wanted or 10 loot keys right off the rip so this is going to be a great way uh, or a good little bonus to start on the server so to enter all you got to do is leave a like on the video subscribe to the channel and then drop your minecraft username in the comment section down below and in episode one which will release probably very soon after the server releases probably saturday or sunday i will let you know who the winner is so make sure to enter now with the server basically they're trying to mix og skyblock and then obviously all the recent new features that the skyblock community has been seeing so one thing that pointed out to me right off the rip is all of the skull gear basically the skull gear is all you need and you'll spawn in with it so right now i'm in the starter gear which you spawn in and if i go ahead and right click the boots as you can see this is how the enchant system works for everything you kind of just right click it there we go the sword and you basically get to pick and choose what you want to upgrade which i love this system so much more than the old system that most servers used where you would basically have to buy enchant books and it's just a lucky chance if you get the enchant you were wanting to get if that makes sense so this system i like a lot more like obviously with the hoe you can buy the replant hoe which makes it a harvester hoe for farming and all that um which i love now if i go ahead and talk in chat yo as you can see l0 next to my name this is my player level so how this works is throughout the ores i've mined and the mobs i've killed and the crops i farmed i actually level up so slash p level kind of shows you the progression and how to get that progression bar moving um and what this means it does a lot but as you see as you level up you will earn more rewards from mini crates so if that makes sense and how i interpreted it is let's say i open a super crate when i'm l0 i'm not i'm gonna get a certain amount of rewards right and then say later a week later i get l5 or something if i open that super crate again i'm gonna be gaining better rewards like better money pouches better spawners and all that so I love that system. I've never even like heard of this, but I think it's really fair. Like I love the layout of it. And uh, obviously if you're two weeks into playing the map, you're not going to be wanting the same rewards you were getting on day one. So that should be good. Now, obviously OP Legends is known for their warp mine and their little mob shaft. They've literally had it. I think every single skyblock map for the past like years, as far as OP Legends has been out, they've always had this mob shaft mine, which I freaking love. And how they're doing at this map is this first island you're seeing right now is the island that will be released upon the server release. And then they will be releasing new islands in and all that each week or each day i, I don't kind of i honestly kind of forgot but yo oh they i guess they have skills as well i had no idea that's good to know so i'm guessing slash skills is how that works hey that's sick but this island will be released right off the rip and then they'll be obviously releasing more updates throughout the server you can mine and kill mobs and then if i go down all the way here yo get out of your c miner yo get out of your dog i don't want none of that but if you go to the very bottom this is where you can then be teleported into the actual pvp world and uh then there's also regenerating chests here i don't know what that's about i don't know if that's like a new and improved envoy system or something but uh yeah, so this is where the PvP will take place, which is really cool. Now, one more thing I noticed. Obviously, there's a lot of things. I'm not going to get to them in this video. You're just going to have to kind of check out the server on your own and figure them out. But if I go ahead and do slash shop, right? And then let me, oh, if I could type slash shop, go over to the farming shop. As you can see, wheat right now has a deal going. This is daily deals they're adding. So if I do slash deals, basically, as you can see, there's only six items right now. They said there will be seven usually, but every day a new deal pops up so it says up to seven items are selected each cycle up to four positive and up to three negative so for instance wheat today wheat is selling for 26 dollars when originally it sells for 25 so 
today you would probably specifically want to farm wheat if that makes sense now same with bones same with ender pearls and same with gunpowder now as far as fractured iron as you can see debuff sell price five dollars so actually that barely changed as you can see like a negative 0.03 so really that there's no change in there but and same with here negative 0.09 so that kind of shows how the buffs work like some days you may not want to sell items and kind of save them in your chest and some days you'll want to sell certain items because they're making more money that day hopefully all that made sense and then i forgot i mean if y'all didn't know already they got sick cosmetics like if i do slash backpack i don't have that many but as you can see i have this plunger and block but they're both used for prisons and then obviously this hermes helmet that i'm wearing right now which is pretty freaking sick baby i love it but with these credits i'm giving away the a thousand credits i mean y'all could come in here and buy this stuff this is sick you can basically buy cosmetics with your credits so you'll have to see that i just kind of noticed that at spawn thought i'd throw that in here as well but as far as all that goes i think that's all i'm gonna kind of release y'all in this video obviously i'm gonna be starting a series on here so if you just uh tag along and keep up with the series you'll figure out a lot more I'm super excited for it. If y'all are wanting to join me, join my Discord in the description and hit me up on Discord. Let me know, like, yo, Slate, I want to join your island because I definitely want to recruit some of y'all. I know I got, like, two people already for sure joining this Saturday, but I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure you can have a lot more than two other people on your island. So if you want to grind alongside us, let me know, and uh, we'll get that set up. But I'm super stoked for June 11th, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Skyblock Utopia V2 releases. As y'all know, I'll be online so, uh, you know, hop on and, and play alongside of me. But yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.